So now we've gone through these two submenus and recorded those and set those menu options. I'll again record those into the custom reset slot one. So down to reset slot one, right arrow and set to record. So I'm going to now come out of the menus and you can see I'm on the information screen, the live view info screen with the electronic levels. If you press the info button it cycles through, the camera cycles through different live view information screens and it's cycling through the screens that I configured earlier in the in the live view available information screens menu. So what you can do also is you're in live view to enter into the super control panel to 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 change settings is press the OK button and you can see down the right hand side there are menus that you can go into and along the bottom it shows you what options you can have so I'm on currently on ISO 200 I can come down to auto ISO for instance take the shot and it's immediately on preview we can change the exposure, the auto exposure settings the menu option we set earlier for the function key if we come out into the next info screen let's say we're on the one with the histogram if you press the function button that toggles between manual focus and single auto focus so in single auto focus I press the button every time I press the button half press the button to take an exposure it does an auto focus if I press the function button we're now in manual focus half press and it doesn't refocus so you can take a shot another shot and there's no refocus each time if you don't like that format press the info button while it's previewing info button and again it cycles through different styles of display for showing you the preview so we'll have the shadow and highlight view there